Okay guys, hi, welcome to Hannah's Backyard. Today I have a quick little update of the garden. Um, you'll see it, I just take you kind of through a little bit, show you some of the tomato plants and what I've done with those. Um, like I said, just a really quick update. So hope you guys enjoy it and we'll see you on the next one. Okay, so this is a gator full of tomato plants. Now mind you, still got all of my tomato plants it was just anything that was hanging over um, and in here I just cut it off I have had way too many tomatoes not enough time look at my garden it's weeds <laughs> but you can still see I have plenty of tomatoes still on the plant but this way it will cut back on on what I have so oh my goodness I've just I'm this has been too much it's I've been overwhelmed look at my nice squash in there I don't even know if you can see it it's too bright out here to see my camera but I got watermelon my corn's done um, so I'm just gonna let the stalks dry this is the honey nut squash we're letting those ripen they're all green I don't see anything changing colors yet on those um, but yeah, the tomatoes, I'm at like 200 pounds processed and that's just, that's more than enough for two of us. The zucchini, everything's just a mess. So my next goal is to get this section cleaned up. Um, I pulled out one of my kale plants. I think I'm going to pull out the rest. They're just, they're done. Um, so yeah, now it's just slowly, we're going on the first week of September here coming up in a couple of days. So the garden is still rocking, but I just don't have the time. I'll give you a quick overview. My cannas are looking really nice now. Um, I got a couple really nice watermelons yet that I'm still waiting for ripening. Got a little bit of lettuce in here. There's all the basil. <laughs> the squash bugs are really starting to take off now. So I gotta put some long sleeve shirts on, shirt on and gloves and get this stuff taken care of. Um, same thing with all of these tomatoes, I just started just cutting. That still has one plant, it's huge. Are all the yellow cherry tomatoes. And then I still have all these tomatillos that are starting. Um, let's see, I still, I got some in here. You can see they're starting to ripen. So I gotta come through and pick these. And cucumbers, they're still rocking. But things like, I just gotta pull them out because I haven't been picking them. And I just got tons of weeds. My flowers, you can't even see them with all the weeds. Peppers are doing really well. My serrano fell over, but it's loaded with um, peppers, which is why. So yeah, you can see a pretty big difference here on my tomatoes, but it just had to be done. So um, they're all splitting because we just got a bunch of rain again. This is a weeded mess but my dog comes in here. You can see I got the watermelon in here. Um, I'm just gonna walk in here because it's already, but this tendril's drying. Ooh, so I think that might be a ripe. This tendril dried up. So I think these might be wa ripe watermelon. I've been having some terrible luck with that. It's a big old weed mess. So it's just coming to the end of the season for a lot of this stuff. And here is, I just, I have 40 pounds in the roaster right now, along with all of these. So I think I found a home for these ones. Um, yeah. So this Romanesco plant is huge and beautiful, but it's doing absolutely nothing Romanesco wise. <laughs> and this one, the bees are just loving it. And so I gotta come through and take these plants out. So slowly but surely we're getting it cleaned up for the year. So there's just a quick garden update. It still looks pretty from a distance, but when you get in here, it's a pretty big weeded mess. So anyway, there's my little update. When I go by with all the tomatoes, uh, my back bed, I'll show you the update on that. Okay, so here's my back bed. I'll get off the gator. Um, I weeded everything. 
These are where my potatoes are. They're ready to come out. I'm just waiting for time. They're doing fine. Just sitting in here. Um, it doesn't take much. I can, we got a lot of rain yesterday, so everything's pretty wet, but I can dig down um, pretty easily and find, well, I say that and now I won't be able to find any. I found quite a few yesterday as I was pulling weeds, but they're in here. It's really nice loose soil. So I just got to come in here with a shovel and pick all of that. The cantaloupe and honeydew, which I'm thinking, I've never grown this. So I heard when they kind of get a yellowish color like that, that they're probably, that's ripening. It's not quite ripe yet. Um, so yeah, I think I'll be eating that pretty soon. You got some cantaloupe starting to look like cantaloupe. There's quite a few in here actually. So I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, the corn is done. Once again, just kind of letting the stalks dry. So that's the update on this bed. So let's go dump this and I will see you guys eventually. I don't know about next week. I'm gonna be busy the next couple weeks, but hopefully you'll get little clips and stuff as I um, clean up the garden. So we'll see you guys later.